The 4,000-word short story, The Greatest Gift, written by Philip Van Dornstern, was inspired by a dream Stern had one night in the 1930s. In it, a character named George decides to commit suicide by jumping off a bridge, but is stopped when someone happens by and strikes up a conversation with him. The mysterious person eventually learns that George wishes he'd never been born and grants George his wish. George soon discovers that no one he knows recognizes him and that many of the people he'd known were worse off in their lives because he had never existed. Most prominent among these was his little brother who had drowned because George had not been there to save him. George eventually gets the stranger to change everything back to the way it was and is now glad to be alive. Stern initially sought to find a publisher for his short story but failed in this endeavor so decided to make a Christmas card style gift out of it and printed 200 copies which he sent out to friends and family in December of 1943. This Christmas card soon found its way onto the desk of RKO Pictures producer David Hemstein and later was purchased by Frank Capra's production company. The latter subsequently adapted the story into the full-length It's a Wonderful Life, which debuted in 1946, completely flopping on its initial run in theaters. However, it ultimately became considered a Christmas classic, which surprised Capra, who claimed he didn't see it as a Christmas movie. 